Hello children, today we are going to learn about the most common and diverse sea creatures. Yes, you guessed it right. We are going to talk about fish. There are many different types of fish. Some are big, some are small. Some fish are found in fresh water like lakes, rivers and ponds, whereas some are found in salt water like oceans and seas. Some fish are bright and colourful, while some are masters of camouflage. What is camouflage? Camouflage means when one is born with or adapts its body to blend in with their surroundings so that they can hide and protect themselves. In spite of so many diversities, there are some characteristics common in all fish. All fish are vertebrates, which means they have a backbone just like us humans. However, unlike humans, fish are cold-blooded, which means their body temperature is dependent on their surroundings. Fish breathe through gills. They lay eggs. They swim with the help of fins. The back fin pushes the fish forward, while the fins on either side of the body help the fish steer. Most fish have scales covering their body. Can you see? The ears of the fish are hidden and their eyes do not have eyelids. Fish don't need them underwater because dust can't get into their eyes. Fish have a sharp sense of smell which helps them find food. Some fish like the catfish are herbivores which means they eat only plants. Others like the shark are carnivores which means they eat creatures. A group of fish is called a school. Fish travel in big groups for protection from predators. The smallest type of fish are gobbies. They are less than half an inch in size. The biggest type of fish are the whale sharks. They can be more than 50 feet long. That's the size of two and a half giraffes put together. Some animals like dolphins, whales, Octopus, jellyfish and starfish are mistaken to be fish since they live in water. However, dolphins and whales are not fish but mammals. Jellyfish and starfish are invertebrates, so they are not fish either. Fish are also kept in aquariums where people can go to see them. They are a major food source in most parts of the world. In India, we not only find fish in the fresh water rivers and lakes, but also in oceans and seas that surround our country. Since fish live in water, due to water pollution, many of them are endangered. We can help our little friends by not throwing garbage into the water and thus protect their habitat or home. So children, I hope you enjoyed learning these amazing facts about fish. There are many more exciting animals to learn about, so do keep watching.